hey guys welcome back to my channel and welcome if you're new so in today's video i'll be showing you guys how to edit a pdf on your iphone so if that is something you're interested in stick around for the rest of the video so the first thing you actually want to do is to ensure that you have microsoft office and you can find this on the app store so this is a very versatile and useful app to have especially if you're someone who types a lot or you engage with pdfs on a regular basis it allows you to transform pictures into documents you can sign pdf create pdfs and so on it has a 4.6 star rating and there are actually other information that you could take the time to read to get to know more about the app so let's launch microsoft office and get into it so once you launch the app you'll be greeted with this interface right here and you'd be required to upload your documents then you'd simply need to click on actions in order to edit the pdf so once you click on action you would see that there are quite a few actions here you can send a pdf scan a pdf and so on so i'm actually going to change the pdf to word to make it changeable so once you click on that you'd be required to select the document that you want to change and it might take a few seconds to actually convert into word so once the conversion is completed you can click to add information or omit information so for example i'm going to be adding my name to the pdf so my first name is patrice and my last name is doily i'm also going to be adding my title which is miss and afterwards i'm going to be scrolling to the bottom of the document to add my name once more so once that is completed i'd simply click on the three dots in the top right hand to save the document now you are required to select the location of where you'd want to save your document to and once you have done that you'd simply need to click on the three dots once more and select export so after selecting export you need to click on pdf to change the document back into a pdf file and you'd simply select export at the top right hand corner and it might take a few seconds to actually export the document so once that is completed you would simply go back home and you'd see that the document is saved let's say for example that i wanted to add my signature to the document i would simply need to click on action once more then i would need to select sign a pdf and select the document which is the one at the top and again it might take a few seconds to open the document so i'd need to scroll down to the bottom and it says tap where you wish to sign so you can simply tap anywhere that requires a signature on your document and then you'd be able to add your signature so what you could actually delete the signature if you're not happy with the way it looks that is just an example that's not my actual signature and you could actually tap to adjust and move the signature around and once you are finished you'd simply need to click on the check mark in the top left of the screen to save changes so that's the end of the video if you guys found this video useful or if you liked this video please like share and subscribe also please turn on your post notification so you'll be notified whenever i upload videos thank you guys so much for watching